And you are? I'm Chris Squire. Okay, and this is lightweight. It is, we're sitting inside a four metre inflatable globe called lightweight. Okay, and this is here for Coast of All through until Sunday? That's right, three days, here, three nights. Okay, okay. So uh, you're projecting images and tell me what it's doing. Yeah, it can project a number of different things. Obviously, we've got kind of video, still images, we've got sound going on. Uh, we've got uh, live tweets, uh, we've got a bit of interactivity in terms of um, movement, tracking movement outside the space. Okay, so that was the, uh, somebody was telling me that there's an eye that, that, that watches you walk around yeah. the outside, is that, is that right? When you see the shape, this, this giant ball, we began to think what kind of things work on there giant eyeball seemed to be a way to go. <laughs> so once he was there we thought well he's got to move around and the best way of moving really is to watch people. Okay. So there's a, there's a range of sensors around the outside so as you walk around it will it'll track you and okay. watch you. So presumably for each venue that you go to do you do a different kind of multimedia presentation? or? Yeah obviously there's, there's some things which um, do repeat or we our favourites mm -hmm. and other ones um, we make an, a new so this is this is a lovely piece for me one of my favourite bits the simplest really is just mm -hmm. snow just uh, snow falling and it kind of starts off quite lightly and builds up and gets stronger and stronger but um, other pieces we've got a lot of a lot of footage of Scarborough uh, from the 60s, it's a sort of mm -hmm. travelogue film from the 60s, mm -hmm. uh, which is from the Yorkshire Film Archive. So there's bits of that which we've treated in different ways. Right. I've also got a piece of uh, footage of um, some people dancing on a beach oh, from yeah. 1926. Yeah, so, uh, so a mixture of sort of really contemporary stuff and some pretty historic. Did, did you say that the line drawings that just preceded that, they were from that kind of era as well? Did you say that? <laughs> That's right. Well, that, the <laughs> oh, <I'm making laughs> that, that bit of footage was uh, it was archive footage from 1926, but it's a kind of bit of a funny look to it. And the things which work on this screen actually are light shapes against yeah. the dark. Okay. So I used a filter which just found the edges, yes. and they became kind of line drawings okay. of those dancing okay. girls. <laughs> cool. Cool. So uh, it, look, it looks a bit like an animation, but actually it comes from film. So where, where was, um, obviously this is a, a work in progress because you've been talking about new things <laughs> for Scarborough, but yeah. I'm just wondering where um, where it's gone down the best, where, you know, where's the best reaction you, you've had from it, what kind of, what kind of crowd enjoyed um, it the most? It's, well, and we were in York at uh, Illuminate York oh, yeah. and we had huge audiences there. And people, people talked came, about that a lot yeah. in Scarborough. Oh right, people kind of go expecting to see interesting visual pieces really. So uh, so they spent a long time with us watching yeah. it. Uh, but also uh, I think another one was uh, in Marsden we, we did a Halloween event and we had little films which were kind of little fright films on there made with young people and it was in a little park and the, obviously the people that made the films were there and their families and friends such a such a focus to the whole event. Right, such right. A, it, it really worked really well there. Uh, so right, right. it can it can you know it can work in, on the bigger, almost civic yes. kind of scale and the kind of little neighbourhood right, event right, right, kind right, of scale right, as well. Right. So that's uh, that was pretty good for us. Excellent. So what's what's new? What's what's on the cards for it in development? What secret things are in? Yeah. Uh, well, it, it's ever evolving. And what a, what am I? I'm a tinker, an avid tinkerer, I think. I just don't uh, ever, ever seem to stop. So, Well, maybe that's the thing with multimedia. Someone yeah, said yeah, it, yeah. it's never, ever finished. You just give up at some point. But uh, for us, um, 
I think the exciting things now, this is new, this is a new sort of transition sequence we've been working on to, to move from one thing to another because it's such an eclectic set of content that we needed some way to bring it together. So we've got this idea that it's sort of scanning scanning the ether, scanning the local area and, and pulling in kind of all this range of different media. Uh, and so this, this is sort of beginning to work for mm. us mm -hmm. and that's, mm -hmm. that's quite good. Um, other things, are the, well the Twitter thing is brand new, yeah. it's the first yeah. time we've ever had that. This is live Twitter sort of brought in and got a kind of a little dongle which so it's, it polls the RSS feed from Twitter and uh, it's kind of, it's working, but it probably doesn't look as finished as we ultimately expect it to be. But we but, can, but if, it does work. If, if you tweet with the hashtag Coast of All, it'll it in the end it. appear on, uh, <laughs> on, on the lightweight sphere. Absolutely. In, Absolutely. in the sun court. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, so that's kind of new. Uh, coming up, um, well, one of the things I'm thinking is, is how we how we can use this piece really in a more, slightly more performative sense. Here we are sitting on the inside now. Um, and in fact, it was one of our starting places was using using this as a shadow screen, a giant right. kind of shadow to make giant shadow plays. Mm -hmm. And we've kind of explored the whole, the whole range of using video because the video projectors create such a good crisp shadow. Yeah. So we can't yeah. really see it with this piece now, but you can see where there is there is um, yeah. light. Uh, it's, it's really good for shadow plays mm -hmm. and, and working with shadows. So, is, it, is, that, is that kind of the pixels that I can see? Yeah, that's the right. Text no, the, that's the pixels of from the projector. Right, yeah. okay. Those but are things that merge away from distance. But, uh, yeah. There is a, a very weird acoustic effect in here. That the sound <laughs> goes around the sphere and uh, a kind of a sibilance. It's, uh, it's, it's really, really interesting. Yeah, yeah, and definitely. So I wanted to ask you as well, uh, one of the things I'm kind of interested in in this video series is just how people got into you know, where where they yeah. where they are. Not not the long <laughs> not the long story, but the you know well. um, <laughs> really if someone thinks this is this is a brilliant idea, uh, you know, I, I I would like to do that when I grow up. What <laughs> you know? What, what's um, the career path? Yeah, what's the career path to having your own lightweight? I mean, is it? Have you come? To, have you come into it through performance, through theatre, or That's are you right. a techie, or are you a teacher, or what? You know, what's your? Yeah, um, what, what are you? Well, theat in, my roots are in theatre. I'm right. doing physical theatre, right, ironically. Okay. When we started out, we were just uh, making pieces which were, um, which which had kind of no objects or very few objects. You were a theatre company. Uh, yeah, that's right. We're so, how did company. you go from a theatre company to this? Was it just a bright idea and some funding, or? Uh, I think it was through film, really, uh, oh. that we sort of started to get into this world uh, of, of more of technology and digital media. Uh, obviously, you know, there's a, there's a kind of film link to theatre in a sense of yeah. performing performance of film, and so we sort of moved through that. Um, mm -hmm. I guess I've always been interested in technology and. And other other things, and the kind of visual. Well, I mean, I love galleries and, mm. and you know, artworks and so how, how many are, how many are there of you doing? Is it is it just you making <laughs> this happen, or, or is it a, a theatre company of four? Because on your website, you, there are the other products yeah. or, or, or yeah, yeah. services that you provide, aren't there? That's so right. this is one of a few. So yeah, well, is it just you? When we when we started out, we were trying to build a company of people. It's awfully difficult to uh, sustain that in this era. So really now, I suppose it's, uh, it's a bit of an umbrella organisation under which I mean I'm usually involved okay, in everything. Don't be embarrassed. It's all right. We, there's only us. <laughs> no one else will know. I can confide in you. Now. Yeah. Uh, but but uh, I mean, I mean, I kind of, we tend to work with a kind of extended pool of people, and yeah. new people come in and, and things. But, uh, that must be the theatre company. <laughs> Well, I don't know whether it is, whether the theatre companies 
Well, have a call with people who, who know each other and trust each other and tend to work together and then you pull in other people yeah, that's that's right. particular roles and things. I mean, there, yeah, someone said it can take 10 years really to find your identity and find your voice. Yeah. Uh, I think that is, is often best done through a kind of joint exercise. In work. So, I suppose that's what gets me in, into this field of work, what, through theatre, but all this as well. I mean, I couldn't do all of these things that, that have ended up making this yeah. structure, but, uh, but yeah. somehow be able to, you know, harness uh, and pull a team of other people and uh, everyone brings their own yeah. perspectives, but uh, somehow coordinated and focused on, on, a, on, on a kind of clear outcome yeah, cool. is, uh, is a really rewarding thing to do. Absolutely, so. absolutely. So, uh, so I guess if they want you to come along and bring your shiny ball, <laughs> um, it's what, is it ImpossibleTheatre.com, is it? What is it? Uh, it's Impossible.org.uk. Impossible.org.uk. No, not impossible theatre at all. No, no, we, we kind of, we've been leaving the theatre. I mean, we started out impossible theatre, but it kind of leads people to expect us to do yes, shows. Do so uh, yes, now we're, we're known as impossible. Okay, cool. So, uh, yeah. Uh, yes, available across the globe. <laughs> yeah. That was a pun. I didn't intend that to be a pun. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it's effortless now. <laughs>